A collision between a car and a man driving a golf cart on a city street is prompting the Port Natchez police chief to issue a warning. 47-year-old Robbie Wayne Chapman died last night after he tried to cross Highway 366 on his golf cart and drove into the path of a car. KFDM's Haley Bull explains the chief and families in the area believe some drivers are ignoring safety precautions when they get behind the wheel of a golf cart. Spray paint still stains the road. He uh, always rides by and he always waves and they always got music on the on the golf cart and everything. So, marking the spot where Robbie Wayne Chapman's golf cart ride, we heard the big crash and uh, I thought it was a car wreck. Turned fatal. Spencer Allen lives just a few houses away. Went over there and there was a golf cart flipped in the road. And it was it was bad. Police say Chapman didn't yield the right of way at this stop sign at 4th Street and Highway 366. I was watching my sons and his friends play basketball and uh, they, had, they had just waved at him when he went by and uh, we, we had heard a, a crash. He tried to cross the road at about 730 when a car struck him on the driver's side. My son and his friends ran down here and they said there's been a terrible accident down here with a golf cart, the guy that just went by the house. Police say Chapman died on the way to the hospital. Some people who live on the street say they see golf carts riding up and down the road all the time. But one of their biggest concerns is safety. It's what it is, a golf cart. It should be on the golf course, not in the street. Beryl and Danny Nowlin have lived on 4th Street for more than 20 years. They do that here all the time. I see them everywhere all the time. This answers uh, most of their questions. And Paul Lemoyne is the Port Nature's police it. chief. He's pointing out a city Facebook page where people can see the rules for driving a golf cart in Port Natchez. You have no safety there. You don't have any metal doors. You don't have any uh, airbags or anything like that. So it doesn't take much of, a, of, a, of an impact that's gonna, you know, that can cause some serious injuries in them. A word of warning from the chief. Markings left by his officers. Reminders of what happened at this intersection. In Port Natchez, Haley Bull, KFDM 6 News. The police chief says some adults place infants on their laps in golf carts and he worries about children driving them. Two years ago, Port Natchez passed laws affecting people traveling in golf carts on streets. Log on to KFTM.com to read about those laws.